Hey guys, what is up? This is Red Timmy Ghost coming to you live through the power of YouTube. Today is going to be just a uh, instruction on the HMS Victory, how to do the planking. I've got my red cap here, that's just a cap of a spray canister. And then I've got all my planks, it's in boiling hot water that is just to soften up the wood as you get with the, uh, the boat itself. And what I do is I normally just form it around the cap or anything of a round shape that you've got lying around there in your hobby shop. And then I normally just use my plastic clamps. Probably all of you guys that does all these models have got some clamp or other in your, in your workshop. So I just clamp it into position, wait for it to dry a little bit, and then uh, it will take on the form of the boat as we need it. Um, so yeah, there you can see there was a little bit of breakage already on this one. Um, I wouldn't want you to just uh, shape it when it's dry because you are going to break a lot of the planks. And uh, using this boiling water method works out quite neatly. I know there's other guys on YouTube as well that use some sorting irons and some other kinds of heat to basically form the planks, but uh, I just found that boiling water does the trick for me. So as I've taken it out now, it's been in the boiling water for quite a bit and uh, I've clamped it in position probably for about 15 to 20 minutes and you can see we've got a bit of elasticity in the plank itself and uh, we've got three four planks at this stage that i want to install it's the one just underneath the, the the deck the top deck planking um there's two that's just normal and then there's two that's got uh, holes in for the cannons that come out on the side so here i'm just applying my gorilla wood glue um the gorilla wood glue does clear dry uh, it, it dries clear if I can say that so there's no residue or whatever left after um, and uh, just applying to all the ribs there I'm putting on quite an ample amount so I can just get it in position um, it does take a lot of time um, basically to dry one of these ones out and get in the position and have it take the shape of the, the, the ribs that we've got on the boat it takes about an, a 45 minute to about an hour drying time um, that's why I said on one of my previous videos I will still finish this boat but it does take a lot of time and effort to just form these planks and just get them to stick on the side of the ribs as we've got it here so yeah I'm just applying it on top just trying to make sure I get it into position without any lines or whatever and just line it up correctly. Here at the front, and that's basically where I just formed it around the cap. I just push it into position so that it just sits neatly and tightly where it needs to go. And then I'll just clamp it from the front with my plastic Mastercraft clamps again. And then that will be left to dry for probably about like I say about 45 minutes to about an hour that's the dry time on the glue itself and then this is what we end up with so I've got my four new planks that I've installed in position there there is quite a little bit of gapping still but I'll fold them sorry about that I'll fold them in um, with some of the Gorilla glue and just a little bit of wood shavings that I've got lying around um, and for these openings, that's basically where the cannons, there's still details that needs to go on there. It's just uh, something that I'll do after I finish all the planking on the ship. Hopefully next week I'll bring out the next video um, when all the planking is done and I'm still going to basically just use some, uh, some sandpaper and just sand it down a little bit and just get everything looking neatly for the front portion here um, in the previous video I didn't know actually how to bend it because it's not a bendable thing 
so I ended up seeing that if I cut it and you can see there where I cut the first piece off and I'm going to cut the other two bottom ones there as well is basically just to cut it there and then I glue each one of them in position with my Gorilla wood glue so it takes on that shape that you've got basically there So guys, I hope you enjoyed this instruction video. Um, that bottom fort, I still need to basically just lay it down a little bit and put it into position again. But I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope this instruction of how I did it will help you guys out there. And uh, please like, subscribe and share this video. Here is just the uh, captain's quarters. I just need to install this uh, windows here and then we'll basically be done with a lot of this ship so guys that's going to be it this is rat team ghost saying cheers <laughs>